In Onshape, you can create supplemental geometric annotations in a drawing, and often this facilitates the creation of other annotations like dimensions. In this video, we will take a look at six different tools. The two-point centerline, the edge-to-edge centerline, three-point circle centerlines, two-point circle centerlines, center marks, and virtual sharps. First, let's create a two-point centerline. To do that, let's click on the icon, and then as we hover over the model, we will get inference points, we can left click on one of them, move the mouse, and then left click over the other one, and we get our two point center line. Then we can hit the escape key in order to get out of the command. For creating an edge to edge center line, click on the command, and then pick one edge, and then pick the other edge. And let's repeat that process again, one edge and another edge, and we have our edge to edge center line. I will hit the escape key, and then oftentimes you need to manipulate the edge to edge center line so you can left click on it and then grab one of the grip points in order to extend it as necessary. Let's do that one more time. Grab the grip points and then move it the way that we want. An edge-to-edge -edge center line can also be created with concentric arcs and circles. For example, let's click on the command, and then I will pick one circle and then another circle, and you can see the center line that ends up getting created. In this view, let's also create a three-point circle center line. And so to do that, we'll hover over the center of one circle, the center of another circle, and then the center of a third circle. Let's hit the escape key. You can see how the center line is created. You can also create two point center lines. Let's click on the command, and then we will snap to the center of one circle, and drag out and snap to the center of another circle. Now let's create some center marks. Click on the command, and then you can pick an edge or a circle, and you will get the corresponding center mark. A virtual sharp is the theoretical intersection of two lines. Click on the command, and then pick two lines, and you'll get a mark at the intersection of those two lines. Let's do that once more, and then we end up with our sharp. Let's hit the escape key. Be aware that if you go to your drawing properties, the fifth tab allows you to control the display of construction geometry. And one choice that you have is that a center mark can be displayed with an edge extension instead of the center mark symbol. I hope you enjoyed this video. For more information, please visit www.creowindchill.com. If you learned something from this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you like this video, please click the subscribe button and ring the bell to be informed when new videos are uploaded. Thank you very much.